so I don't really know <clears throat> if this one is working because I recently got these headphones and it came with this little piece over here so I was thinking like oh maybe I can make videos where I actually have a microphone and it works but I should probably get a excuse me an actual microphone that way the audio would be better and um the fan that's on you wouldn't really pick that up because you would just hear my voice so I guess this is just like a little quick update um so um, all last week it is now November 10th that I'm filming this right now um I literally got sick um I know I'm constantly talking about I work at a daycare because I do work at a daycare and and for all my people who work at daycares who are watching this, you know exactly um, that when you work with kids, they get you sick a lot until your body kind of builds up this immunity towards it. Um, so yeah, I don't, I didn't get COVID. I took a test. I was in COVID. I had a really, really bad cold that lasted for at least two weeks. Um, and also last week on Monday, I literally threw up trigger warning sorry but i threw up um so i don't know if it's because something that i ate i'm usually um i'm usually i'm literally lactose intolerant and i'm not supposed to have dairy but i saw potato salad and i had to have it literally but yeah so um yeah threw up <laughs> and that was like the last day of my period so I'm thinking like maybe it's a hormonal thing. Turns out it was a potato salad thing. And um, so yeah, so I'm definitely feeling better. Uh, I'm not really um, like congested as much. Like I can finally breathe through my nose. Um, a lot of mucus is coming out of me, but I honestly I'm fine with that as long as I'm not like sneezing and coughing and literally waking up to me not breathing through my nose but um definitely feeling better i have a lot of things that i'm start, that i'm trying to figure out so it's like i want to do an artist alley um i just went to comic con and i will be going to anime and lacy um super excited for that i'm going with my sister <laughs> but um but yeah so it's gonna be super fun. Uh, we're also trying to go to this um, Korean restaurant. Um, we've never been, but we always walk past it in the city. So hopefully we can go. Maybe this weekend that's coming up. I don't know. But we'll see. Um, yeah, we have a lot planned um, in December. I really want to do like a small trip somewhere. I don't know yet. Um, actually, I don't know if I should be sharing it yet. Maybe it should just be a surprise for whoever is, like, watching my YouTube videos. Like, I don't want to, like, I want it to be a surprise. I want to be like those YouTubers that are like, this is a surprise. Like, you're going to find out when, when you get the video. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so, yeah, everything is pretty cool. Um, I, in this book that is my poem book um i have an idea i really want to um create a poem book with all of the poems that i've been writing since um oh my god when I've, I've been writing poems probably since 10th grade and i think it might be time to just start like a book collection um, not a book collection a poem collection of all of my poems and just have a, like a theme going um so i haven't told anybody this but on my pinterest which is kiyoki6 k-i-y-o-k-i-6 the number um i have a little uh what is it called it's a folder and it says melancholy happiness and that's what I want the name of the poem book to be. So I kind of did like a visual for it. It's very like, like if anybody knows Halsey's album, 
or her little EP that she came out with in 2014, Room t Room something, Room 93. Um, I kind of got a little bit inspired by that, like the whole like just you're in sadness, but you're also finding like the art and the positive through being sad or through just being in this like state of I'm mysterious, I'm also in my head and it's not bad nor good in there but I don't know yet so we'll see we'll see um I don't know I've just been like really happy recently about my life um while also questioning it because I mean I graduated college if anybody saw my little video I forgot what it was called but it was talking about it was like to I think it's called to keep you to be short with you I don't know if they're gonna post it right there but to be short with you um, that was just a rundown of my life literally what's been happening but yeah I graduated and a part of me is like I want to become an art teacher while also maybe a nature-based teacher I'm literally working at a non-traditional uh, preschool and I feel like that's definitely better for me. I mean, all my life I've been growing up in a like a like a traditional schooling. You know, you have lunch at a certain time, and uh, you don't really get much outdoor. It's just everybody's like sitting in a classroom throughout the entire day. Your recess is probably like twenty minutes at best, maybe thirty if you're lucky, and. Um, yeah, so i just kind of been figuring things out. I don't know if I want to go back to school or maybe... I don't know yet, so I'm not going to talk about that because I don't have my ideas registered yet. So um, hopefully I can figure that out. I'm not going to rush things through because I realize when I rush into things or when I feel like I have to make a decision and it's prematurely... I kind of mess myself up so I'm not gonna do that I'm just gonna kind of go with the flow see how everything is but yeah going back to the poem book because I literally love staying off topic that's just something that my brain likes to do um, but yeah so I would like to make a poem book um, I don't really know how this whole if you want to make a book I don't really know how to start but I'll figure it out I've been looking up like publishers and her Amazon can help publish a book um, I kind of want to do the art for it I just don't know I don't have a vision for it yet but I do know that I want to create the art for it um, but yeah everything has been pretty good I started reading and I don't think I can speak about it on here because you know I don't know who's watching me. I don't know if, like, jobs or family members or, you know, whatever. I don't know who's really watching me, but I started reading a lot of books. Um, definitely, like, romance books and, like, fantasy books. I'm not big on romance books at all, but I decided to take a chance because my friend put me on. So I started reading, I think, like, two of them, and they're actually pretty good. Um, they make me feel very girly. I feel girly because <laughs> I'm not used to books like that I'm used to reading like um, like spiritual books books that um, help you with your personal life um, so just reading romance book kind of like threw me off <laughs> but um, I ended up picking back up on um, like some fantasy books so hopefully I mean they're pretty good I mean I'm glad I'm getting back into reading because last time I picked up a book was probably like two no a year ago literally so I just got back into it and I'm glad I did literally but yeah I'm trying to figure out what else am I doing with my life I mean I've been very chill I literally binge watched um the whole Twilight series this week um, I still haven't gone apple picking, um, 
supposedly there is this one apple picking orchard that's not that far from where um, me and my boyfriend live. Well, it's kind of far. You know, if you have a car, it's like an hour from where we are. And um, yeah, hopefully we can go tomorrow. It depends on our schedules. Even though I don't have a schedule over the weekend, but he does. So um, we'll figure it out, you know. But overall, I've been really good. My stuffed animals are over there. Thanks to my boyfriend who loves to buy me stuffed animals that I want. Um, but yeah, overall, I've been good. Um, I'm trying not to really put pressure on myself. Um, I have a lot of ideas. I've been writing down those ideas. Hopefully I can make them flourish and come true. But um, in the meantime, I can't complain. I really can't complain. I'm, I'm like really happy <laughs> with my life. Even though parts of me is like, I can do better, which like anybody can, but I'm satisfied right now, you know? So hopefully a lot of big things will happen. I don't know. But I do feel like something big is going to happen. Like not bad, but like something that's going to be really good and it's going to help almost everyone. Not just me, but everyone. So we'll see. Alright, bye. See y'all later.